Duckbill anchors are designed as earth anchors to support trees and other structures in terrestrial environments. We've used them effectively to anchor structures underwater. Depending on the substrate, they can be surprisingly easy to deploy. Rocky, coarse grain substrates are harder to penetrate than sandy or silty substrates. These duckbill anchors are purchased prefabricated with the anchor head and an accompanying stainless steel cable and loop. These can be customised to a desired length, but these ones are 1200 mils or 1.2 metres long. To deploy, a diver descends with a fence pole driver, a driver pin, and I have a very old one here, and the anchors themselves. The driver pin has a tapered end and you place that into the duck bill itself and place it into the substrate. And then you use the fence pole driver to hammer that into the ground. Each anchor is hammered in at least half a metre, so about half the length of this cable. It can be pretty tiring, so take your time, and you might need a couple of divers to complete the job, depending on the difficulty of the penetration. Once the anchor has been hammered to a sufficient depth, the driver pin is removed and placed through the anchor loop and pulled abruptly upward to cantilever the anchor into place and voila, your anchor is ready. These can be used to anchor a variety of different coral nursery designs, including coral nursery trees and floating frame nurseries. Over time, you'll need to monitor the nurseries for degradation and deterioration to maintain their integrity. But solidly designed material implemented correctly should last many years requiring minimal maintenance.